All right. Let's open it for questions for Jalen, please. Jalen, just from your perspective, what happened in the third quarter? Uh, they went on the run. Uh, we got a little bit out of out of hand, out of sorts, turned the ball over, uh, just gave up way too many baskets. I think we lost the game in the third quarter. Jalen, what is it that makes it that you guys have not been able to kind of pull out of these tailspins at the, uh, the fourth quarter in game five against Milwaukee at the third quarter here? Why is it that they continue to make their runs? Like after Eme called the timeout in the third quarter, Jimmy had two steals, two buckets after that. Why can't you guys get that back under control? We come out and we play basketball. Um, most of the time we play good basketball tonight. They got the best of us. Um, we do a, a good job of responding and answering runs for the most part. Um, it's a part of the game. You know, give credit to Miami. They outplayed us tonight, especially in that third quarter. Um, I got to be better. Um, we got to be better. Be more poised in that situation. We go look at the film um, and we come back. Jalen, yeah, obviously, um, Marcus was hopeful that he'd be able to play, couldn't quite do it. And then Al's absence was a pretty big surprise. How does the kind of, sudden of the suddenness of that uh, affect you guys and preparations? And I know you guys generally have gone through stuff like this a lot this year, but something you really weren't prepared for. And how do you kind of bounce back if Al even isn't allowed to play the next game? Um, we just gotta, we gotta be even more disciplined. Um, obviously we wasn't prepared um, to be without Al. Um, and, you know, we was definitely wasn't prepared to be without Al Lance Smart. So um, it's not an excuse. We got to be better. Uh, we still had control of the game in the first half. We lost control in the, in the third quarter in a little bit. And uh, we just got to be better. Got to play better on both sides of the ball. Uh, more discipline. We foul entirely too much. Um, and we let the game slip away from us. You know, um, that's the story. Jalen felt like Yime was really getting in you guys during one of the timeouts. And I know Marcus was saying, saying some words during one of them. What, what sort of things were being said in timeout to try to stop those runs during the third? Um, during that time, they was a the harder playing team. You know, they was beating us at 50-50 balls. It just seemed like everything was going their way and we were kind of standing around watching. And, and that's not what we do. Um, we got to get in there, get in the mix, um, be more physical, master physicality, master intensity. And we didn't, you know, like I said before, um, I got to be better. Um, I will be better. The Celtics, we got to be better. Um, and that wasn't you know, our best effort. We got we to gotta put our best foot forward playing against a team like Miami. And they outplayed us tonight. Jaitlin, over your last three games, you're averaging over 40 minutes a night. How realistic is it to be able to keep that up? Um, it's very realistic. I miss the playoffs, you know. Um, it's lose or go home. You got to be able to, you know, I work my whole season to, to be in these moments. You know, my body um, is fine. I just got to be able to make the right plays and see the game and, and read the game. And tonight wasn't my better, wasn't my better game doing that. I got to handle those situations a little bit better. Uh, I got a rhythm going later in the fourth quarter. Um, and I think that was good carryover into the next game. But um, I definitely got to be better uh, for our team. These uh, first two series you guys had, you're going against KD Giannis, like two giant stars you can see everywhere. The whole defense, defense is kind of focused on them. Then tonight when Miami made that big run, it was a lot of Butler just kind of sneaking out of nowhere to seal the ball, get a box out, stuff like that. So how much is just the way that he kind of likes to lurk in the shadows, throw you guys off tonight? Um, that's what he does. You know, we knew that going in. Um, obviously, it's a new series, so we just got to be able to transition better. Tonight wasn't our best night. Um, but we let them get away with too much, you know, 18 free throws, you know, that's um, way too many. Um, so we got to be better. That's all I can say. Jalen, uh, along those lines, you guys have been very good at responding after losses all postseason. What kind of things go through your mind as you get ready for a game two? What kind of things can you learn from a night like this that you need to take into game two? You watch the film, um, when you see things, the film doesn't lie. So you get to see, you know, where you lost the game. You know, you get to see all the details. And, and that's what we're looking forward to seeing and breaking down and seeing what we can come out and do better. 
uh, for next game. Um, uncharacteristic of us to give up 118 points. Um, and we can do better. Uh, I know we can. So um, we got to, you know, transition to the next game, almost learn from it, leave it behind, and get ready for the next one. That's it. Going back to Jimmy, how unique of a challenge is he, the way that he's playing in this postseason right now? He's comfortable. He's, he's very comfortable right now. Um, and we got to do a better job of, of breaking that rhythm that he's in. Um, and that's it. We got to take the challenge. Jalen, how do you match uh, their toughness with toughness of your own? Because they seem to have kind of a mental thing going back two years ago over you guys. How do you combat that? Uh, we come out and we play basketball. At the end of the day, that's what it is. You know, we got a lot of tough guys in our locker room that won't back down. I mean, we were out too. We would, we were without two of them tonight. Um, but you know, we got a tough team, resilient team. Um, so hopefully, we get some of those guys back. But even if not, um, we still could play a lot better um, than we did tonight. So I'm looking forward to the next game. We just got to come out and play better. <laughs>